How did I go from being an IT auditor at a big four accounting firm to a data analyst at a Fortune 500 company? Hey, what's up everyone, Akin here. So I quit my job at big four after being at the firm for one year. If you wanna learn more about that, you can check my I quit my big four job video. In this video, I'll be sharing my experience in making a transition from IT audit in public accounting to data analysis. So this won't be how I landed a data analyst job video in detail but I'll make that one in the future. To give you a background, my job at Big Four was my first full-time job out of college. I was an IT audit associate, and my main responsibility was to review and verify that our clients' IT systems are accurate. I was on Excel almost all day every day, but for documentation purposes. So I wasn't really doing analysis using Excel, other than things like view lookups and other simple formulas. We were using Excel for documentation purposes, so the work papers that we had to prepare were in Excel format. I was also constantly on calls with clients, so it was more like a consultant role in that sense. After deciding to quit, I thought I'd go into data analysis because I had a related degree, which is computer information systems. And when I was in my senior year, I was applying to data analyst and business analyst roles before I got an offer from a big four firm. First and foremost, it's not uncommon to go from audit or IT audit to data analysis. It's not like transitioning from psychologist to software engineer. But there are still things that you have to do to make that move because the work that you do in audit is gonna be different than what you'll do in data analysis. So after the busy season, I made myself a plan to land a data analyst job. First, I brushed up on my skills like SQL, Excel, and Tableau by watching tutorials online because in general, those are the required skills. Then I found myself a mentor through a nonprofit organization, thanks to one of my data analyst friends. I had bi-weekly meetings with my mentor. He suggested that I should start working on small projects that I can show or talk about during the interviews, which could be the most important thing in a technical role. Because you can only watch so many tutorials and the employees wanna see that you can actually use those skills. When I was like halfway through my projects, I was already applying to jobs and got a couple of interviews as well. After about 10 interviews, I finally got an offer from a healthcare analytics company and accepted it. I had a backup plan just in case I wasn't able to get an offer from another company. My plan was to try to transfer internally to data analysis within my firm. I knew it was possible, but I wasn't sure if they'd let me do it since the audit department is always short-staffed and they usually need more people. On workday, I found the hiring manager for a data analyst position at my firm. So I was planning to speak to her if I couldn't get an offer in the next month. Thankfully, I didn't need to do that because data analysts at the big four firms work a lot too, even though they're not auditors, but the work they do is to support the audit teams. So after getting an offer from my current company, I gave in my two weeks and never looked back. Now that the busy season is two weeks away, I'm glad I left and don't have to go through another busy season. Long story short, it wasn't really an easy transition to make from IT audit to data analysis, I thought having Big Four on my resume would have helped more. It probably made some employers want to interview me once they saw that I worked at Big Four, but it was definitely less than I was expecting. But if I was applying to an IT audit or an audit role, I feel like I would have gotten an offer a lot faster, like within a week or two. So to sum it all up, my transition went some like this. Watch tutorials like SQL, Little Python and Tableau, mentor meetings, personal projects, and land the job. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and make sure to check my busy season at Big Four Accounting Firms video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.